Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two uh, chocolate eggs. These are the Clarence and Bean Chocolate Company. We found these at Home Goods. They were $7.99 each. Uh, and we actually bought four, uh, but they're so large that I thought I would try two in one video and two in another video. So you'll have to be looking for that one. Um, I have the Pink Fizz. I have gin and tonic. So the Pink Fizz is the ideal blend of delightful melt-in-the-mouth chocolate combined with the fizzing taste sensation flavor of Prosecco. Um, there are four servings in the container. Uh, Mine says the exact same thing, so it just says gin and tonic. Gin and tonic. Uh, it's 1.44 ounces or 41 grams, it's 230 calories. And this is a product of the United Kingdom. It's literally an egg right, right in the package. It, it is. It no has, wrap, no anything. No, but you know that they're very good at saving on the wrapping. Oh, yeah. They yeah. don't well, waste. It was, it was sealed. It was taped at the back. Yeah, they don't waste a lot as far as wrapping. And it, it sometimes surprises people who watch my videos that are in uh, the United Kingdom that we do wrap so much yeah that would like, be wrapped in plastic wrap or yeah aluminum or something. and they're like that's so wasteful and and i get it i totally get it so do you think this is just hollow it feels hollow if it's got a liquid in it it's gonna go everywhere it's hollow yeah i thought it would be okay so um it is www.clarenceandbean.co.uk and they're in devon It's nice. Mm -hmm. It's got like pop rocks in it. I think that's delicious. Push that chocolate oh. against your tongue. Have to chew it. It's got pop rocks in it. Popping candy. It does. It does pop. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like that. That's really good. I didn't think I would, but I like it. I didn't taste prosecco. I wouldn't know what Prosecco tasted like if you handed it to me and paid me money. I've had it on an airplane on the way to uh, didn't London. Didn't you say it was really strong? No, no I it, didn't, it wasn't bad at all. I didn't mind it, but this is TMI. Alcohol runs right through me. So I had the Prosecco and literally 15 minutes later, <laughs> had to go to the bathroom. And so you don't want to drink a lot of those on a plane unless you plan on be, you know, getting up and down a lot. I try to use the airline bathroom as little <laughs> as possible. So this is gin and tonic. Yeah. yeah, I don't, I don't like getting up and down. I don't like that one as well. That does have a different flavor. Mm -hmm. I don't like it. I mean, it's not bad. It just tastes. I guess it's the, the gin. Um, I just don't like this. You know, normally I like gin, but it tastes earthy. It the, yeah, it does. It tastes like grass. Mm -hmm. It really does, and I don't know what it is, but mm. instead of tasting sweet, it tastes like something that you've pulled up out of the ground. Mm -hmm. it, it's not. It's not good to me. Yeah, I don't like that one, but I love the. The pink one. I do too. The pink fizz. The yeah, that prosecco. was really good. And I love the little popping candy. Yeah, and really, you don't taste the prosecco at all. No, you. It's just a. It's a sweet chocolate um, that has popping candy in it. Yeah, know. but it's very good quality milk chocolate. It is. Now this one, like I said, I didn't really like at all. Um, you couldn't taste the chocolate in that no, one really because no, it kind of got killed yeah so so i hope you enjoyed the video hope this helps some americans out when um you're looking for things here um then you should look in home goods because home goods has all kinds of different things specialty items so if you're looking from overseas for, and stuff. right so if you're looking for something to stand out in the easter basket that's always a good place to shop so I will have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching.